When your transplants have reached the size you prefer and they're close to being ready to move outside, they need to go through a process called hardening off. Now, plants grown indoors lack the development of a sufficient cuticle to protect the leaves from the ultraviolet rays of the sun. The cuticle is a waxy layer on the surface of the leaves. Think of it as the plant's sunscreen. And it also protects against rapid moisture loss. Now, it normally takes about 7 to 10 days of increasing timed exposure to direct sunlight or 7 to 10 days of constant shaded exposure such as what you might have on the north side of a building in order for the plants to develop that thickness of cuticle that you need. After this time, the plants will be ready to transplant into the garden and direct sunlight. Now, I did a little experiment. Plant A here was grown indoors totally under what we call T5 fluorescent lights. Now, plant B was also started indoors under lights, then moved into a greenhouse with a polycarbonate cover. And then plant C was started indoors under lights, just like A and B were, but it was moved out into the greenhouse and then it was hardened off outside on the north side of the greenhouse for seven days. Here are the plants after one day of direct sunlight exposure. And this is two days exposure. Now, even though all three plants survived, the one that was grown under artificial light only and did not go through a hardening off process, the leaves were severely damaged by exposure to direct sunlight. The other two did well because the light intensity in the greenhouse was sufficient to induce the development of a thick enough cuticle to prevent damage, and the one that was hardened off had a chance to develop that thickened cuticle. So as you can see, hardening off your transplants is a good way to get your plants off to a good start so that they don't have to go through too much stress when you transplant them. I hope this has been helpful, and this is Gary, and I'll talk to you later in a future video. Bye.